Nick, it, it looked like you, you had a lot of energy stirred up for the end in the fourth quarter with you running. Were you fresh <clears throat> as ever in the fourth quarter? Yeah, I felt good, good going to the fourth. I mean, I think we did a good job uh, the whole game of pounding them. Even though things weren't quite opening up for us at first, we did a great job of leaning on them and O line kept pressing uh, the defenders. And uh, eventually in the fourth quarter, it opened up for us. I mean, you got used to top, uh, how you top that first touchdown? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, it was awesome, though. It was a great experience. Uh, you know, everybody did their job, blocked for me, and uh, I was able to get in the end zone. So just talk about a spin move and breaking a couple tackles there. <laughs> um, you know, I just, it's, it's a lot of things that we work on at practice, you know, uh, making moves that once you get to the second level. So I just did what my coaches have uh, coached me to, and it worked. I mean, is a, I mean, is a spin move just instinct? Is it, I mean, what leads up to that? I would say, yeah, it's instinct. Uh, I kind of just saw him coming from the corner of my eye and saw where his momentum was pulling him, and so I just spun the opposite way. Nick, what did you think of his run? Yeah, it was good. I mean, it was an amazing play. He he broke some tackles, made um, made guys miss, and I mean that, that's things that I always know he could do. And I'm glad he showed everybody here that he can do it. Nick, when you heard the call on the touchdown, did you think it was your chance to put him away? And what did you see on the play? On what call? On the touchdown. Which one? <laughs> your your touchdown to ice it, basically. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it was a great call. It, it was well blocked. I don't think I even got touched in the game. Uh, in in that place, so, I mean, it was well well blocked by everybody, we're, we're, well um, executed by everyone, and it was uh, able to ice the game. You Mitch, what you threw the ball in the stands? Are you gonna try to get it back? Oh yeah, we got it back. We got it back. <laughs> and Nick, what are you thinking when Baker has to go to the locker room after making that tackle? Well, I mean, um, it's, it's next guy up. You know, Case Keenum, uh, he'd be ready if he had to go in. We all trust in Case, and uh, we, we we know he'll do a great job for us. But we all know Baker is super tough and. You know, it's, it's not a doubt in my mind that he won't be back. So I knew he'd go in there and get checked out. He'd come back eventually. Did you sense something different about Baker when he did come back in? He's always the same to me. I mean, he, he's a tough a tough guy, always intense. He's ready to lead this team, and he does it every day. Uh, Coach said he didn't want Baker to get hit again after he came back. So I think he handed the ball to you guys more. Like, Do you like having that responsibility, closing out that game there? Oh, for sure. I mean, if you put it in our hands, running backs and O-line, I'm sure we'll, we'll always get the job done which we've had in the past. And so it's just, it comes down to how we practice our, our mentality to run the ball, even though, even when they know we're running the ball. So if you put it in our hands, you know, we'll, we'll do our best job to get it done. Nick, how tough was it to lose Jarvis on the second play from scrimmage? And then do you guys on offense talk about, you know, rallying, picking it up without him? Yeah, it was tough. After he went down, it took us a while to get going. I felt the energy kind of drop a little bit because I mean, Jarvis, he's a big part of our offense. He brings energy and intensity. He, make, he makes big plays. But like I said, next man up, you know, d got got more opportunities to make plays, and he did for us. That's just our mentality. If a guy goes down, we're all prepared for him to step up, and I think our, our team did a good job with Jarvis going down today. I mean, what does it do for your confidence when you have a nice return like you did on the first one? Um, it does a lot for my confidence, and, I, you know, I think it's a big confidence boost for the team as well. You know, I feel like we had a lot of energy coming in after that, and so I was really happy that, you know, I was able to be a part of that. Nick, you mentioned not getting touched on the touchdown, but even Kareem had a, a run just to kind of cut back. Like, how fun is it to run in that zone scheme? Yeah, it's fun. I mean, our old line and uh, Coach Callahan, he gets those guys up front moving, gets some guys going. And you know, as a running back, we got to do is press our track, you know, um, have good eyes, and it always opened up for us. But a lot of credit to our old line for opening things up.